I'm Nathan Maguire and I completed an advanced diploma of interior design and I'm a qualified interior designer at the Laminex Group. I've always been interested in interior design since I was a kid. I always remember when I was younger moving my room around a lot just to see what, what kind of you know, space I like. From there it's kind of developed into something that's become a career for me. I decided to enrol at Central Institute of Technology and um, start working on my advanced diploma for interior design. I think it's important to incorporate my Indigenous um, culture into my designs. I think it sets me apart from any other designer out there and it gives me my niche market. I use stories and colours that represent something of Aboriginal art. In my second year, I actually won a design competition. The judges came up to me and said, we tried to look past you, Nathan, to look at everyone else's butt. My design, just, they said it just uh, topped everyone else, so that was really exciting and that, I think that's where it all started, where I thought I can actually do this. After I won the Australian Training Award, I, it was kind of like a whirlwind. I didn't really, um, I didn't know, I wasn't expecting anything, so just having, being recognised for what I do and that I worked hard for, for it and then getting the award was, um, I felt like it was a real credit to me. How I got nominated for the WA Training Awards, I was sitting at my desk and I was doing my work and my lecturer came up and just put the application form next to me and I was like, well, what is this? And he's just like, yes, you should go for it, I think you'll do really well. To represent WA for the Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander community, it really gave me a lot of confidence to keep pursuing the career that I want. I went to finalist week in Melbourne for the Australian Training Awards. I still remember it's just like meeting some of the most inspiring, amazing people I've ever met. The advice I would give to other Aboriginal people when they want to start um, skills training is find what you're passionate about or something you're interested in and research and find, find your alternatives, find what suits you. It may seem scary at first as well, but it's always, it's always better than you think.